children of the not just messing with you. Welcome to Tech of Tomorrow. We're bringing you all the tech all the frackin' time. What's on the tech table today? Steel Series 9H gaming headphones. Now, these things are 200 bucks, but these things are pretty badass. For one thing, they're 7.1. They totally cover your ears. They're sound canceling. They come with their own sound card. That's right. 7.1 USB sound card comes included with it. So if you have some crappy sound card or don't want to use the standard USB, this one comes with a really good USB sound card right in a little thing. You stick in your thing and up and go. But let's stop talking. Let's jump in and let's check out what the 9H is all about from SteelSeries. All right, folks, so here we have the box lying out in front of us, SteelSeries 9H gaming headset. Now, one thing interesting, though, works with Mac, Windows, iOS, and Android. So basically, we'll work with anything you want whatsoever. That means you can plug this thing into your Mac, go plug in your PC, use whatever the heck you want, and go on the road. Premium tournament gaming headsets. Skask Premium de Categorie Tornos. Whatever the heck that means. Still series, you know what the heck it means. It means the same thing. On the side of the box, nothing. Just shows the microphone, which we're going to talk about, which actually tracks nicely in there, which is very interesting. Let's real quickly jump around to the top here because uh, they have these things that are in association with other world champion professional gaming teams. The Native, the Nanis, or what is that? Natas Vinceri. Then we got the Ninjas in pajamas. Those guys sound like tough motherfuckers. The Tai Lu and the Fanatic, all there. Rock and roll. Other side of the box, basically the same thing. Here is the back where it says winning is everything. Steel Series 9 inch gaming headset supports Dolby Pro Logic 7.1. Has its own audio mic compression. You guys are always wanting to talk about the mic. Well, I guarantee the mic on this one's going to work good because it has all of its own stuff that's geared towards that specifically. So these things are supposed to have increased clarity. Here is the USB connection and the 3.5 millimeter. You get both. So if you have a really good sound card and you don't want to use the USB sound card, you don't have to use it. That's enough of that, folks. So I got my trusty little knife here, kind of a little cool, my little Ninja Star knife here. Make a cut little insertion here, nice and there. Another one right here, yeah, we'll dabble do. Cut, cut through, yeah, All right, and there we go. Pop that little thing there. Kaboomy, kaboomy, kaboomy. All right, we got a little free floating thing here. Free floating, free floating to throw at the damn cameraman. That's how free floating it is. Pull these headphones out. You guys haven't seen that in a while. That's right, because we have Mr. Jesus back behind the camera again. He took a little hiatus, but he is back. So there's nothing else in there. We'll toss that off to the side too. And look, here's the headphones. Look how beautiful they are. So look at the design. The black is beautiful. All right, just kidding. This isn't it. This isn't it either. In fact, what we got right off the bat right here, let's go ahead and pull it out and check it out, is ba-doom, ba-doom, ba-doom. This, my friends, is the USB sound card. That's right. Believe it or not, this is all it in a little nutshell. Pretty interesting little thing here. Then we've got more cables, adapters and such. More adapters, 3.5. Adapters, adapters, adapters. So basically all the plugs and everything you need. Then the drivers should be right inside of here if there is any drivers. I don't think there is any required though in this whatsoever. I believe it's just plug and play either on a Mac and a PC. So nope, it's just basically a little, little guide here. Steel Series, 9H. Get this stuff out of the way because I know you guys really want to see what's underneath the hood here. So here we go without any further ado. Woo! Yay! All right. So here we go. Oh, you know what? Totally wrong on that, folks. I thought that uh, this part back here was the actual sound card, but this is just the controller for it. So my bad. I'm going to go back and address that real quick. I see that now. Remember, I've never seen this before either until I just opened it up. So this is basically the on and off switch, the volume control, but not the sound card. My bad, my apologies. Here is the actual USB sound card. Download software here. So basically you do have to download software to use that. Here's all your different plugs. Steel Series USB sound card version 2 Dolby. 
All right, now, check these out. Now, one thing I want to say right off the bat, folks, is we tried to find out what size the drivers were in these, and we couldn't actually find them. Now, I believe that they're going to be 50 millimeter. They look bigger than 40 millimeter, but there was no information available for that. Hopefully, by the time I get the review up for you guys, you'll be able to see it. Now, very, very flexible. You guys can see it like a twisty little pretzel. Very flexible. All up inside of here. All up inside of here. I said I'll ghetto now. Now all up inside of here. Now to be some poem and some shit. That's right to keep it soft. All right, but there is. It's all nice and padded inside of there. And these are very well padded. Um, this is very very soft, very subtle. So it's not going to be like making your ears uncomfortable or anything else. The drivers underneath these little foam things here. So here on this side, we see the retractable microphone. You go just take your thumb like this and you can move that little bad boy out and it's totally flexible to move to wherever you need it to be. Here we see the Steel Series. Their logo is right there on the side, their name rather. But they're very nice. Now I'm gonna go ahead and put them on my head. Okay folks, I gotta be honest with you, man. I put these on and it felt like I was getting a massage almost. These things are so soft and comfortable. Wow. Yeah, these are very, very nice. They're not very heavy at all. They feel very comfortable on my ears right here. Like I said, it almost feels like a massage. It's just really, really soft and nice. No hard edges, nothing to be uncomfortable at all. The retractable microphone, like we said, pulls in and out. You can place it up by your microphone. If you don't want it to be in the way whatsoever, you can just shove it back up all the way in there. I don't see these things being uncomfortable at all for long periods of time whatsoever. They're comfortable. So basically folks, it's, you know, these headphones right here, all these goodies basically here in my hand, man. And that's what comes in the box. All right, folks. Hope you guys like that. Like I said in the beginning of the video, these headsets are coming to the market at about $199. You might be able to find them on sale somewhere out there. If you guys are interested in checking these out, down there below the like button in the description will have all the information for you folks to check out if you're interested in getting yourself a pair. Now, a lot of you guys always say, why don't I do a mic test? Well, I have to save something for the written and review stuff, so that's why I do it. These are just the unboxing. We take a look at the product, then we bring you guys the review. That's just the process of the whole little thing. But anyways, if you guys do like this video, hit that like button. You guys know what to do. I'm Elric. I'm out of here.